Hello, you wonderful people. Well, this is awkward today. I had my birthday some time ago, and I got some arty stuff. I didn't make a whole video, but I still want to share what I got with you. One of the bigger presents was the Mission Gold Pure Pigment set of 24 colors, plus a black and white. So to use these colors properly, I got myself a metal tin, a metal palette, with clear um, pens to fill it. And I got a mint one because it's beautiful. Here you can see the booklets that are include, included in the Mission Gold set. They come in a, a variety of languages and I hope that there's something for every one of you. It also comes with a swatch sheet, a chart of all the colors available in the Pure Pigment set or in the Pure Pigment range. Of course, the Mission Golds also have other colors available that where pigments are mixed to um, give a certain hue. The Mission Gold set comes um, with 24 big, big um, 15 milliliter tubes and two 5 milliliter tubes of a ivory black and a Chinese white. I sw swatched the black and white too, but for me, they aren't the most important colors I have in my palette. I usually use not to have a white in my palette, and I prefer a neutral tint or paints gray to the black. So I'm okay with the um, smaller tubes. After labeling the pants and laying out the colors, I started to squeeze these delicious paints into the pens. The consistency is very smooth and nice. The pants were very easy to fill and the paint looks just delicious. In some of the paints, the binder were, was um, not connected to the pigment and I had to stir it up. In a few tubes, I think it was two, there was a little air pocket. But I don't mind that. When making the swatches, I have all already realized that the paints were very, were very vibrant and well pigmented. It was very easy to get a nice color and all of them or most of them are um, transparent. Not all of them because I know that this turquoise isn't. Um, in the colors there's a wide range of reds and only two yellows. I wish there was at least one or two more yellows, but it doesn't bother me too much because I still can mix um, the colors I want using the colors provided. The blues are beautiful and I'm just in love with the greens. The green gold in the set is probably my favorite green gold now. To, mo uh, to make this uh, swatches, I needed just a tiny bit of the color to, uh, to make it look vibrant and beautiful. I also have already used them for a painting. The video for that will be soon on this channel. It was a flamingo and it was very easy to mix the, all the colors I needed to make this painting. Here you can see the swatches up close, and the palette also. 
I hope you don't mind me just showing you the paints and the setup of this little palette. I'm pretty happy that I have it and I'm sure I can have a lot of use out of that. Thank you for watching. See you soon. Bye. Thank you.